A big celebration at Trumbull Regional Medical Center today as staffing levels have now reached a level where officials could reopen a floor closed during the pandemic. Trumbull County reporter Nadine Grimley tells us what this means for patients. One, two, three. Yay! A ceremonial ribbon cutting marked the reopening of the eighth floor of Trumbull Regional Medical Center, better known as the Center for Joint Replacement. It was closed during the pandemic due to the restriction on elective surgeries and staffing issues. Now that we have the right level of staffing for the patients that we have now, it really allows our nurses to be able to give that direct focused attention to every single patient. By reopening this floor, hospital officials say it allows most patients to have their own private rooms throughout the hospital. The floor has been open for a few weeks, but hospital staff, city leaders, and members of the Youngstown Warren Regional Chamber got together to celebrate today, while also showing off the hospital's newest equipment, Tableau dialysis machines from Outset Medical. They are the more like the Tesla of the uh, dialysis machine. It's the size of a mini fridge. It's very easy to transport because um, for certain patients, if they're isolated or if they're uh, in critical care, we actually have to travel to those areas to provide the service. The new equipment has already been used twice on one patient. His kidney numbers, his B1 went down from like 97 to 67. It's almost a 30 percent drop and he was feeling well. The hospital used to rely on a third party vendor for dialysis, but with the purchase of five Tableau machines, now will run the program from within. To have those resources in house and not have to rely on an outside vendor, I think will be advantageous to us moving forward. Um, again, the resources are here in house, uh, immediately available in case somebody needs them. In Warren, Nadine Grimley, WKBN 27 First News. Hi everyone, I'm Lindsay Watson. Thanks for watching the WKBN 27 First News YouTube channel. If you want more video news, subscribe to our channel and don't forget to download the WKBN 27 First News app for breaking news alerts.